Okay, guys, here I am again with one more strategy. That's the simplest one, uh, but this is not the huge one. Okay, so first I'll talk about this strategy within two minutes, and then I'll uh, show you how we can convert into expert advisor automated. And then after that, uh, we'll talk about the back testing. And I'll also talk about the uh, few good, important facts which may help you in back testing. Okay. So as you can see in chart, so it's very, very simple one. We need only moving average 50 and moving average six. Okay, that's a simple mean average. That's it, nothing more. So the rule is very, very simple. The moment it crosses the six crosses 50, will buy, crosses down, will sell. That's it, right. So in order to get more profit, uh, we will take help for, for moving, uh, uh, excuse me, uh, the trailing stop you know, the function which we have in MT4. And when it, if you do, if you want to do it manually, that would be sort of hectic. So that's why I've decided to uh, make this automated. And if you are not a programmer, not aware about the coding, not a problem, you can still uh, convert into expert advisor because this is not the uh, complex one, okay? So there are lots of software available on the market. One of them, which I use is uh, EA Builder, okay? But we can definitely do that because it's not the complex one. Or so simply what we need to do, uh, create new, working on MT4, the strategy one, not the indicator. You can also create the indicator and we'll give the name, uh, moving average 60 and excuse me 50 and six okay and then create now we need to give the condition okay so we'll add the condition uh the moving average period six process above the uh, moving average we need to find the moving average here process above 50 extra advisor will place a buy order. You can also click on the box, click on add new, uh, period, let's say six, because this one is six, click on okay. Okay. So what I'm doing here, because you know, you'll come to know later on, you can change the period from the expert advisor's input, okay? I'll show you later on in a minute, guys. And now also we'll give the instruction for check profit, in the 100 pips. We can also make the changes later on in input. For now, we'll leave it as 100 pips. And guys, the stop loss uh, will not give this specific stop, uh, like a stop loss, rather we'll go with the ATR, it's called average to range. I believe you guys are aware about that, okay? So, stop loss. Okay. And we need to give the one more extended condition. It has to be minus. And then we need to find the ATR average to range. Okay. One more extended condition multiplied by value plus second example six. Okay. You can make it uh, ATR. It's already there, ATR six. You can change the value of the CTR later on from the uh, like expert, expert advisor's input. So sell side complete, excuse me, buy side complete. In order to give the same exact uh, scenario rules uh, to sell side, you just need to click on this magic uh, stick. That's it. Guys. So in this tab, we won't do anything because we have already given the stop loss take profit in this tab and the common tab. Here you'll get the option to add the trailing stop. Our function, you just need to click here, add new input, trail stop, let's say um, 10, we, make, we can change later on, okay, and the step, how much is step, right, uh, let's say five or leave it, it is as it is for now, and the trail above, means that right after placing seller buy order, it will not start trailing, but after how many kids movement, then it will be start tra trailing, okay. Uh, we will give the value later on. Or if you want to keep it as zero, then you can do that, no problem. 
uh, short side, just you need to click on this magic stick. And one more thing, very, very important guys, here you will see the loss of uh, options here, but one thing very, very important, you just need to click uh, this one. Maximum open trade at one time, it has to be only one. Otherwise, expert advisor will keep on opening multiple orders that will create a huge problem for you and for broker as well. Okay, so for now, we are going for, with the fixed lot size. An alert you can, you know, tick here for the alert function. And then we got input. These all input we have given earlier. We will give here trade size for now because we need to pick the specific trade lot size. So here we got the source code, right? We just need to copy, control C, go to this uh, meta editor, Create a new, next, I'll give it the same name, which we have already given on software. That was M A P T N six, right? So whatever comes here, select all, delete it, and copy and paste. From, this is where we uh, copied, and we need to paste here. So this comes from when you click on the MT4, you just need to click on and this button, meta code language, and this page will open up. I've already opened, okay? And uh, one more thing guys here, I would like to mention that uh, if you run a back test, right? Back test and you click, just give me a moment, I'll show you that. Click on view, strategy tester, okay? So, here you see option visual mode. If you do not click this, then the speed of the expert advisor back test will be very, very, very fast because nothing is going on here. However, whenever you create any indicator or expert advisor, it is very, very important to check manually if the e expert advisor working exactly as we have given the instruction. For that you need to click on here visual mode but the problem is you know you know the speed here if you click on let's say 31 34 so okay 31 so it will run very slow it will be it will be running as the live market all right very hard to wait but if you click on 32 it will be running like uh bullet train you want to be able to see exactly what happened, when happened, right? So to figure that out, I have uh, coded some code, which I've already coded. And just to uh, save your time, guys, I've uh, mentioned some around here. Yeah, this one. So what you need to do, one second, guys. You just need to copy and paste, okay? And where you need to paste, I'll show you. Copy all the things, everything. Go to the this section and uh, under this expertic function at this point hit enter control v paste and remove this line the bottom line okay leave this one and then track it all the way up you click on here hit enter and then paste here However, one thing you need to make sure that this is the this is empty for. So, in place of input, we need to make it for extra. It stands for external. If you are testing an empty empty five, then in, you need to put input in place of external. Okay, and then we will just compile. One second, guys, we got error. Which line? Twenty one. And this line, it is 29. Uh, excuse me, guys. So we also need to remove this one. My Polish. Okay, that's it. We've got no error. Now we will backtest. Uh, so we will refresh here because whatever changes we made, that will be updated here. And you guys remember what was the name of the expert advisor that was uh, MA50 and 6 on this one. And as I mentioned, I like working with uh, GPP ULT fair for this specific this uh, strategy. 
already selected here. And about the time I will select, uh, because if I go with the 2015 to 2020, five years back test, it's going to take a hell of a lot of time, right? And this video just for the uh, educational purpose, so we don't really don't need to go that long. So what I'll do, I'll just uh, maybe I'll go just for six months and that would be enough, okay? Yeah. We will just uncheck this, uncheck this, okay? And uh, period one hour. And here, guys, I believe uh, I have seen that uh, some of traders, there is a problem, a confusion actually. The confusion is, if you want to set a spread, or uh, let's say two pip, and your broker is a five digit broker after decimal one, two, three, four, five, you see that? So you need to put here two zero, okay? That will count it as a two pips. If the broker is four digit broker, then in place of two zero, you just need to put two. That will count it two pips, okay? It's very, very important. Because whatever pip amount you put here, that impacts the backtest result. Okay, so for now I'm putting here 15. Means that I have uh, this is a five-digit broker. So 15 is times four, 1.5 pip. And I believe that these days, you know, very competition between firms broker. So it's not very hard to find this much of a spread along with commission. Okay, and now we'll go to input section. Now you got input section here, go to input. You, you see, I was talking about this. This is the period. If you want to make changes, you can do so. Take profit, we will leave this 100, ATR 6, and trail point for now will change 20. Trail step will make it 10, and trail above will put here, let's say five. And the speed is 50. Uh, since we are not actually uh, doing in value mode, so we will do it zero. Yeah, one thing is, if you are not, if you haven't clicked here, so you need have to click this one zero. Otherwise, uh, it will impact your speed. And normally, if you are running a, let's say, uh, so like a not a very complex expert advisor, so you can you know put uh, value fifty to hundred. That would be enough. You can watch visually. Or if the expert advisor is very very complex, so even if you put forty value here, that will decrease the uh, the visual speed considerably, okay? For now, we are putting zero. Okay, guys, so, okay. so it's done. And trade, let's put in one standard lock. Because we have enough money, okay? Now hit start. Excuse me, guys. Oh, I see. I'm sorry, guys. I should have selected here uh, June. Okay, now hit enter. So in the mean, it will take uh, guys few seconds. So in the meantime, I would like to mention that uh, if you want to a programmer coder, that's your passion. So you need to learn by just you using this software. Not going to help you guys. You know, it will it takes uh, not only months but years to be a good programmer. But if you're not a programmer, not interested, and just want to you know, uh, create an indicator or a simple expert advisor, that definitely can be so. All right, test is done, let's see. Okay, graph, wow, not bad guys. So we started with 10,000. In this um, six months period, we got this much. A report, <laughs> um, drawdown 70.70%, profit six something. And quality 90%. So the quality, guys, quality here is 90%, right? If you want to get a 100% quality or 90, I don't think 100% is there available. If you want for 99%, then I think you need to take help of third-party software. You can do that. I just don't want to talk about here because this video will be very, very long, okay? So this was just a, like, guys, uh, uh, overview about the strategy. How do we backtest and about the coding right not exactly we cannot say coding but the web uh, like ea development using a software okay guys and i also will uh, make available this 
expert advisor which i have coded on the link description below okay guys hopefully guys you find this video information okay and uh, trade safe that's it for now i'll come with the next video